Hi everybody, um, I'm back. I'm feeling a little creative today and I want to do something. So um, I've got Natalie here. I really didn't think about this opening. <laughs> what do you think I, I brought you here today for? To get crazy. <laughs> but you know, flower hair. <laughs> Fashion's biggest month is which month? September? Yes. Using the Devil Wars Prada. Who is on this month's uh, Vogue issue for September? I Who was chosen? <laughs> Beyonce. Oh, the queen. What is she wearing? Flowers. Flowers. <laughs> and then this oh is the British God. issue. Rihanna. And what is she wearing? Flower. With that being said, we now know that we need to wear flowers on our head if we want to be fashionable. Florals for spring. Groundbreaking. I was thinking, well, first of all, this looks a little bit like big and hot and impractical, True. right? So like you can't you can't just go out with a garden on your head unless you're Beyonce or Rihanna, obviously. So I was thinking of a way we could make it a little bit smaller, a little bit tighter, and a little bit more sculpted. So it's like a bit easier to wear. Like a flower clown. <laughs> Crown? Yeah. Oh, that's so basic. <laughs> Been done. So I'm gonna help you guys today because I know you all wanna incorporate this look into your daily routine, especially in September, we wanna be fashionable. I'm thinking flower vase hair. Wow. <laughs> Step one, you wanna find something in your house that is in the shape you like. It could be as big or small as you like, but it needs to have a hole inside and you'll see why later. So for example, I'm looking in here, we have a few possibilities. If I empty this, I could use this. This, for example. Oh no, that won't work, unless you remove this. The easiest way, the easiest way to do it is taking inspiration from last year's Christmas tree hair and using one of these water bottles. So whole, you can choose any size you like. Separate your hair into two parts. Make sure it's brushed out smooth so there's no tangles. Take your water bottle or whatever you choose, place it onto your head, and then you wanna wrap your hair around it. You want to make the base of it look like a vase, right? So it needs to be a tighter. So put a bigger elastic. Right. Now's the time you can get super creative with the shape. Then take another small elastic and place it into the middle of your vase. And then once you get a shape you like, take the ends of your hair and just shove it through the hole of the bottle in the top. And then simply take whatever flowers you want and just put them in. So the fun thing about this is you can make any shape of vase you want and if you have colorful hair, it will look really cool. Um, you can use plants or flowers, any kind of flowers you want that match your personality for your outfit. Okay. Well, she's all you'd ever want. She's the kind I'd like to flaunt and take to dinner. But she always knows her place. She's got style, she's got grace. She's a winner. She's a lady. Our goal is to find a florist. I want to change up this look to real flowers because right now we have fake. And I just want to experiment. So we're going to walk around, see what we can find, see what reactions we get. People are already starting to question what the heck is going on.
reactions are really good. It makes people smile, it makes people laugh. The people that like it the most are the older men. I have to say, I don't know why I was expecting the older ladies to love it, like the flowers, but the most photos are taken from the older men. She's getting it on the trend. Uh, she said her hair is not long enough. I'm gonna be scared to death. <laughs> this is waiting for you in the bedroom right now. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it for this video. I hope you got inspired. Get on this trend or be ugly this September. But really, I would love to see your creations. You guys are really good at this stuff, so I'd love to see what you do with this. Let's use the hashtag flower vase hair. Use that hashtag, take pictures, take videos, do creative things like I think little pigtails, like two vases, that would be cute. Have fun with it. I can't wait to see what you guys do and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Say bye. <laughs> Did you have fun today? Um, yeah. I was well, let's tell them. This was actually the best reaction yet, so... If you want a reaction, go outside. They're like, oh, it's interesting. Um, it's art. It's a performance. So, it's my, it's the best Taylor DIY so far. You think so? Yeah. Oh, it's no. my favorite. There's too much pressure now. I don't know what to create next. Stop it. If you don't, alright. Thanks for watching. Bye.